This is Split West National Park, which is also a UNESCO heritage site. And uh, we are traveling from Split to Zagreb. And on the way, we stopped at uh, the National Park. As you can see, one million tourists have visited this park. The waters flowing over the limestone and chalk have for thousands of years deposited these barriers and uh, created natural dams uh, which in turn also have created beautiful lakes and uh, caves and the waterfalls. This uh, geological process is known as uh, Tufa Barriers. It is fascinating and beautiful to look at. It is also an ongoing process. These waters also have a high rate of uh, calcium carbonate. There are 16 uh, terraced lakes uh, joined by waterfalls. This park uh, also covers about 1000 hectares and uh, you can see the forests which also support a lot of animals and uh, birds. So it has a rich flora and some fauna like the brown bear and grey wolf which we were not fortunate enough to meet. Litfis has a number of trails and you can choose which trail you want to go on. Uh, there are also shuttle buses and uh, a ferry boat. So it is an electric boat which connects over the lakes and uh, you do need good trekking shoes to go on the trails because sometimes you have to go down to the water and also climb up uh, to the mountains. We are waiting for the free bus service and uh, the times are given so you have to watch out and board the buses accordingly. Litvis spans over a 30,000 hectare area so you have to at least uh, see the park for two days and uh, some people prefer to stay close to Plitfis. There are hotels and resorts. Remember, while buying your tickets, you need to know which entrance you are entering from. This is the route to the electric boat. You have to climb down a number of steps uh, and then avail the boat. This also acts as a shuttle, so you have to wait for the other boat to take you back. While visiting Croatia, you must visit Plitvis. It is uh, worth the effort and uh, it is also